morning from Kruger Park Lodge we are on our way somewhere very very cool this morning I can't wait to show you guys what we are doing it's been my dream to do this since I was a little girl so I'm very excited but let's go ready Riggs let's go Chef. We are here at Elephant Whispers in Hazyview. Super, super cool. So we are going to have an elephant encounter. I'm super excited. It's something that I really wanted to do since I was little. Yeah. How excited are you? Very excited. Usually an animal we respect a lot. And we still do, obviously. Obviously. So it's going to be amazing to see them up close. We are super respectful of elephants and usually stay far away yeah. from them and yeah so it's going to be cool to get up close and personal with elephants excited very very excited let's go so in southern africa We've got too many elephants. Kruger National Park, you've got a carrying capacity of 7,500 elephants. 7.5. As we speak now, there are nearly 30,000 elephants. Way, way too many elephants. The big guy, Tembo, he weighs seven tons. So an elephant like Tembo can eat between 300 to 500 kilograms of food a day. Then coming to our training methods, our training methods is quite simple. It's tried and tested command and reward system. You ask an elephant to do something, if he does it, you have to reward him. Same way train dogs, even wives train husbands. <laughs> good boy, good boy. Good <laughs> we don't force them to do all those commands. We just follow their natural behavior. When the light is on, it stays on forever. They've got good memory. They don't forget. Yeah. Her name is Lindiwe. She's 20 years old, and Lindiwe means the girl that we've been waiting for. Standing next to this giant of the bush was a feeling I cannot properly put into words. 
Seeing every detail of this magnificent animal was mind-blowing. To actually see how intricate an elephant is designed was unreal. From the agility and the utility of the trunk, the giant fly swats are for a tail with the rock-hard bristles, and even the vein system behind the ears was incredible. This experience really enriched our lives and just once again confirmed our opinion on elephants. We have to respect these giants of the African plains. Elephant whispers really exceeded all of our expectations. Next time you are in Hazyview, definitely pay them a visit. Okay, so we are back from Elephant Whispers. Yeah, at Kruger Park Lodge. We are just walking to go play some putt-putt tricks. Yeah, to uh, wait out the load shedding. <laughs> oh, first load shedding. Yeah. We are on stage four yeah, in Hazyview at the moment, so that's not so good. And then when we get back, we'll make some brunch. But luckily we can be outside in this area. In this <laughs> beautiful area. So yeah. yeah, lucky. Okay. Let's go play some putt-putt. I have an idea. My wife is gonna kick my butt. I don't think so. I haven't played putt-putt in a long time. But we'll see. But you can. <laughs> you know how to. The loser is about beers, Rix? Beers? Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Yes, boys. We've just finished playing a round of putt putt. Putt putt is super cheap at X. Six rand a person. So for the four hours it cost us 24 rand. Super cheap. But we tied. Yeah. But Ricky played left, so technically he won, but. No. <laughs> Rick, who buys the beers? I Do I buy for you and you buy for me? I think you can buy around, I can buy around. <laughs> it sounds that good. That sounds like a plan. <laughs> okay. All the beaters. Lots of beaters at the moment. But anyway, just going to enjoy a relaxing afternoon. Yeah. And then go walk around later. Go to the hippo hide. Hippo hide and doing some birding. Alright.
After a lazy afternoon, Stacy and I headed for the trails. This is one of our favorite things to do wherever we go. Just grab the cameras and go explore. No route, no plan. Just enjoy what you come across. We explored all the little routes next to the river as well as those deep in the bush, just taking in all these tranquil surroundings. Switching off, relaxing. No traffic, no noise, no stress. What more do you need? We ended our walk by watching the sun set over the river at the hippo hide. Just watching the hippos play and seeing all the birds coming into roost for the evening. These unplanned moments usually turn out to be one of the more special ones of a trip. Next time, just do yourself a favor and go walk. Explore a new path, a little dam or any new area. Nature always delivers. <coughs> Lovely little walk, Riggs. Oh, that was amazing. Beautiful, huh? It feels like you're walking through a forest. It definitely. With is. a river running next to you, it's stunning. And we luckily ticked off a bird. A new one. Our list. A mountain wagtail. A berg kuki. <laughs> yeah, super cool. I saw Otter run across the road. I Rikus always was, miss it. I was up in the trees. Rikus is, was busy looking up in the trees and the Otter ran past us just in front of us. But we will see you guys back at the house. As you can see, we are still in the dark at the moment because load shedding, stage four. I don't know what's going on. The power is still off at like eight o'clock. It was supposed to be on like an hour ago. Yeah. So we are in our fourth hour of no power. Yeah. And hopefully tomorrow is the last day of stage four and then we'll have... Yeah, I'm not going to stage five, whatever <laughs> stage five is. Quite in the case. Stage five is like a blackout. So um, we saw the elephants this morning, Rex had yeah. an encounter with them. It was, I must say, we learned so much, but it is quite a controversial place to go to I guess and in general not just the specific place just yeah in general yeah. like a place where you get like up close and personal with elephants elephant whispers does use rescued elephants obviously we don't like seeing the animals in any form of captivity or being handled by people like that you'd much rather want to see your elephants in the wild but like they also mentioned, they can't release the animals anymore. But in any case, but, but it was yeah. still very, very insightful, very yeah, educational. Yeah. That's the whole thing. They, they, they use the elephants. They only have five elephants. So there's, there's not 
90 whatever elephants yeah. roaming around there and they they use them very educational very yeah, we it's a great purpose for them about the elephants literally from the the eyelash until the tail yeah. you learned everything the insides outsides anatomy yeah. they they're very knowledgeable the people and you learn so much which was really cool but yeah. and, and they really do care for the elephants very yeah very you well. can see the, and the, the the guys that take care of them yeah. really care for the elephants but I've, okay yeah it was amazing yeah just, so we've <laughs> we've uh, explained everything but uh, it was it was a, a great encounter mm -hmm. I enjoyed it a lot and they were, we had a great walk here around the mm. uh, the lodge, Lots of the, the hippo walk or the hippo trail. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was very very nice. We will do that definitely again. Mm. Let's go to bed, Rix. I'm pretty tired now, so that we can get up super early tomorrow morning and head into the park. Yeah, and play the wildest golf. Oh no, not, no, no, not no, again. No, oh, okay, no, it's not that. We... Yesterday's video, not today. So yeah. hopefully we can get in nice and early that we yeah. are first in line. Yeah, so. Uh, I haven't said this in a while, but press all the buttons <laughs> and we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Okay, bye. Cheers. We admire elephants because they demonstrate what we consider the finest human traits. Empathy, self-awareness, love and intelligence. Thanks for watching and enjoying this incredible day with us. If you have any questions regarding Elephant Whispers or the surrounding Hazy View area, Please drop us a comment below. See you in the next one. Cheers. Good morning ah! from <laughs> Thanks Adi does. Good morning from Kruger Park Lodge. We are on our way to <laughs> oh. Good boy. Good day. Yeah.